Alrighty. <laughs> Remember how I complained about snow every day for like two weeks? Well, you're about to start hearing it again. <laughs> and it's fog this time. This is crazy, crazy, crazy. Crazy for Vancouver. I've never seen it this foggy this many days in a row ever. <laughs> wow, crazy. I don't know. Anyway, um, not a not a whole bunch to talk about today, you guys. Um, I went to the gym today again. I actually I went today because a friend asked me to train him, um, and I actually had a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> Maybe I should be a trainer. I don't know. <laughs> I took a couple of classes thinking I might want to go that route, but um, I haven't I haven't taken the last one yet, and I don't I wasn't I wasn't planning to because I was really just taking it for my own personal interest. Um, but it's kind of fun bossing people around <laughs> at the gym. Anyway, um, uh, so yeah, that's why I went today. It was supposed to be a home workout day, and uh, I uh, actually got almost no sleep last night. Um, kind of had company for a little while, and then when they left, uh, just kind of tossed and turned for a couple of hours. I just couldn't couldn't get to sleep. So by the time five o'clock rolled around, you know, I was still awake. And, uh, and then I realized the inauguration, I really, really wanted to watch that. So I did set the alarm, um, and when the alarm went off, I was kind of bolted right away because it's also a work day. So, you know, so I watched a little bit of the inauguration, did a little bit of work. So I got like four hours of sleep, so I'm really bagged. So I'm really surprised that I actually got a pretty good workout in at the gym today. But I'll tell you, I did have the option of bailing on my friend because uh, he had lost track of time, and I had, didn't hear from him for a couple hours. And I was like, well, does he want to go or doesn't he? And I was just about to, to say, oh, screw it, I haven't heard from him, so I'm just not going to worry about it and just, just work out here at home. But then I thought, oh, God, I just don't have the energy. I'm so tired. I looked at my weight set, and I was like, oh, you know what? I kind of need the energy from the gym today. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I needed to go to the gym to get the energy off the other people that were there. Um, so when I did hear from him, and he was like, oh, sorry, sorry, I lost track of time, and so we went. I said, well, let's go then. So uh, mostly be because I just really, I still wanted to get a workout in and I just wanted to feel that energy and be able to feed off of it and get a workout in because I didn't see how I was going to have an enjoyable one here at home. So that was a surprise for me and a confession for you guys. <laughs> I don't want to be a hypocrite, but I also don't want to be a liar. <laughs> so I'm confessing that yes, I went to the gym for the energy this time. I went to a, uh, the gym in the downtown area. There's a few gyms around here. The one I go with my regular Friday friend is in a, in a different part of downtown. This is in the business district, this one. So that was fun, too, because there's lots of business people that go to that gym, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Um, so that was fun. Uh, some, some really quite n nicely built boys there. Boy, whew, holy moly. So the eye candy was great. Um, and uh, the workout was slow because my friend's very green and I really had to take, take really careful time with him and straighten out his back and stuff when he was doing specific moves and explain a lot of stuff to him, more than I actually thought I was going to have to. I was surprised by that. So when I finally got my mind wrapped around the fact that my workout was going to happen while he was doing something that I had explained fully and that um, he was doing properly before I could walk away uh, and go do my own thing, um, once I wrapped my head around that, uh, the the workout became quite enjoyable. At first I was frustrated because uh, I was like, oh, I just want to work out. But, um, so anyway, so it was pretty good. And I showed him a lot of stuff. And I hope he, um, he continues to do it uh, or, you know, get a gym membership for himself and go. Uh, I probably will go with him one or, more, one or two more times now that he kind of understands the atmosphere and uh, his, uh, his form a bit better because uh, then I'll be able to work out more while he does, does his own thing and I can just keep an eye on him and make sure that he's doing things properly and not forgetting his form and that kind of thing. So, yeah, I had a good workout. Um, my shoulder's bugging me again. It's not, it's not a big deal. Um, Terry, I know you mentioned, you, you know, not, not to, to, to be careful. Sorry, I'm stuttering. To be careful and not to hurt it worse. It's, it really just feels like a little bit of a strained muscle. It doesn't feel like a huge deal. It mostly just felt it on the cable pulls. So I think it'll be okay. So tomorrow it was supposed to be a day off, um, and I've got clients in town, but it sounds like I might have the afternoon free now. So I might just go ahead and keep going. <laughs> keep going until I have a dictated day off by, from work. So I don't know. We'll see. Um, 
So, yeah, I, for some reason I feel like I'm forgetting something, but my biggest point today was the big confession that uh, I, I went to the gym mostly for the energy this time. So, yeah. <laughs> hope you guys are having a great Tuesday. Ah, you got the day right this time, right off the bat, Tuesday. So I hope you guys are having a great Tuesday, and um, I guess we'll see you again tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye.